it's, it's Palm Sunday, and I know that you also did an Easter egg hunt. So <clears throat> I'm going to talk about two things. On Palm Sunday, Jesus, who we love and is really the center of the Christian faith, a man who lived 2,000 years ago, but we also understood he was not only a man, a person, but he was also God. And so when he came into Jerusalem on that Sunday, this Sunday, everybody greeted him with palms, and they were so excited that he had come, and they waved the palms, and they threw their coats and everything down on the ground that he might ride over those, because that was a royal greeting. That Sunday, even the kitty cats got excited and started waving palm branches. Let's see. was they didn't put their faith in Jesus, so the palms got dried out, and they got all crinkly, and they died, because they forgot that God doesn't work the way we work. And so on Thursday, Friday morning, Thursday night, Jesus had dinner with his disciples, then he went out to pray, and they arrested him. And they took him to court, and they decided he was guilty. And they decided he would have to die on the cross. And the whole crowd yelled, crucify him, crucify him. So those beautiful palms that they had weaved got all dried out and died. And, and Jesus was going to die that day. And, and he died on the cross because his love for us was so good. After Palm Sunday, after the palms all dried and the people didn't see Jesus did what they wanted him to do. And it came time for him to stand trial because the Roman government didn't like Jesus because he was talking about changing things and making things good for everybody. They, they sentenced him to die on the cross and the whole crowd yelled, crucify him. Yes, crucify him. And Jesus was placed on the cross on Good Friday. And of course, he died. But on Easter Sunday, there is a miracle. And that miracle is also celebrated with Easter eggs because out of Easter eggs come chicks. And that's new life out of what seems like something that couldn't bring life. So out of the tomb came Jesus to bring new life for us and let us know how much God loves us. So it's a miracle and it can rain Easter eggs. say a prayer. Oh God, we give you thanks that your son came to be with us, walked with us, taught us, brought the children to him because he loved children as much as he loved anybody. And that though we said, no, we don't want him, the people in Jerusalem said, no, we'll let him be crucified. You didn't walk away. You still love us so much that you raised Jesus from the dead and the message you give us, I am always there. I am always with you. I will always love you. And let us always remember, O oh Lord, that the Easter egg represents new life given to us through your son, Jesus Christ. Amen.